Oh, six o'clock on the dot in the morning. Where are we heading? I need soon to go see Briella. Shout out to Briella. All right, we're uh, heading to Edmonton. So, uh, we'll see you guys there. Holly, Brielle, and myself made it to Edmonton. Brielle slept the whole flight. No, I didn't. I slept three minutes. Holly slept too. She was head bobbing all over the place. I should have got video of that. We'll get her on the way back. Uh, then we'll talk about identifying drives and channeling drives in dogs. This is can be a hot topic um, online. Specifically, be happy, be chaotic, be calculated, be powerful, be vulnerable, truly embody these characteristics at the precise moments and watch what these dogs will do for you. Uh, I, I think that this is a super, super important quote. I think, who, who said this? Who did they say said this quote? George Washington. Of course, it's dog training, exceptions at times. Um, if I notice that the dog is content with just turning around and walking out of the building with you, I may give the dog a bite on its way out, right? Because negative punishment only works if they have hope that they can succeed on getting it. So if they lose hope and say, well, I'm not going to get that anymore, then we're no longer negatively punishing them, right? So they have to believe there's still a chance. So that's like the whole thing. Um, our time, all oh, that counter back there is full of stuff. Um, our time in Edmonton, this trip around, is coming to an end. Um, 
it was I had an awesome time and it was such a great group of people. Um, everyone was really into it, really open, really wanting to learn, uh, very active in, you know, I, I think it was one of the, it took me probably one of the longest times to get through my PowerPoint um, and not being bad, uh, but because everyone was so engaged and like, you know, consistently asking questions. They, they, they have a really good, they fostered a really good learning environment um, for their club uh, that they have out here for PSA. So what I'm going to do, Holly is with me and Brielle is with me. So I'm going to kind of ask them what their favorite parts of the seminar uh, this weekend was. And then we're going to jump on a plane and head back to Toronto. All right, Brielle. Um, so what was your favorite part of this weekend? For me, I don't know for all of people that came, is I got to meet someone that also competes in PSA and is my age, and she has only one letter difference in her name. So that surprised me a lot, and I'm very happy I got to meet her because I also got a decoy for her dog. Wow. So it was pretty awesome. Oh, that was your favorite part. Yeah, it was pretty yeah, cool to see you guys. Yeah, and there was three Malinois there, so I was pretty happy. A lot of German Shepherds, too. A lot of German Shepherds. They yeah. all look good, like. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm going to go uh, find Holly, and we'll see what uh, her favorite part was. Yeah. All right, we're uh, here with Holly now. We're in the airport. We got here a little early, just waiting on our flight. Um, what was your favorite part of the seminar? Um, I think my favorite part for the whole weekend was watching the dog, the light bulb moments go off for the dogs and the owners too. Awesome, awesome. Well, uh, on that note, we're all gonna be uh, heading out and getting on our plane soon. So, ciao, ciao.